Yo, what the fuck is going on, guys? It's your boy Zylo bringing you guys a brand new video. Talk about the 2.0 patch. This patch is a monster, it is a beast, and we are gonna freaking go right into it. We're gonna divulge every little last secret of it. So we're gonna hop up into the first screenshot. Hold up, let me bring this onto my screen here. Okay, one second, one second, one second, and should be popping up any second now. Here we go. There we go. Here's the first screenshot. So, first things we're going to talk to you guys about is some crazy stuff. So basically, if you bought Destiny, if you own Destiny, if you own pretty much any copy, Taken King or not, doesn't fucking matter. You are going to be able to play all the maps, whether it be from, you know, back when PlayStation had these maps, you're on Xbox, Taken King maps, we're going to be able to play, able to play Rift, able to play Mayhem, we're going to be able to play all these maps free of charge for like four days. It's going to be amazing. It's coming out with a 2.0 patch a week before Taken King even comes out, we're going to be able to play all the Crucible maps, so next week is going to be amazing for Crucible, so if you guys don't play Crucible, you know, put on your tryhard mittens and we're, you know, hop right into Crucible, because there's so much going down on there, you know, we might even get some weapons dropping, like this is just scratching the top of it, we haven't even figured out exactly what's coming out with this 2.0 patch, so this is just like, just a few things, we might even get some Taken King weapons, like, this stuff is going to be nuts, the 2.0 patch, the weekly update, all this stuff is crazy, so let's go ahead and take a look at the second picture here. So we're going to quickly look at it. All right, guys. So basically, with the second picture, what we can count on with this is your character. Everything going on with your character. Your level cap basically is increased to level 34. If you guys don't know what level you are right now, you're probably level 20. If you haven't gotten anywhere, like remember when we hit like, like XP levels, we got up to 20, that everything went by light. So it's going to determine our level by, this is the confusing part. So it says your character level will be grandfathered into your highest possible light level from all the gear in your inventory and your vault. What does that mean? My light level is level 34. Will it be, you know, level 34? Will it be, you know, figured out by all the weapons? I don't know. They keep saying both. I've been trying to figure this out for you guys, but I haven't been able to figure it out. It's so fucking confusing. So basically, all of your level will be able to going up by XP alone, and then they're adding the new light level system, so you'll be able to rank up your light level already, so your character level and your light level are completely different, so you'll be able to get your character level up to 34, and your light level, you'll be able to work on that. Okay, so last thing, that's basically it for this one, you know, you're basically everything separate, so quickly, we're gonna hop into the next, the next screenshot. Which is exciting. This one's when it gets starting really good. Starts off, you know, kind of bad, but here we're getting into the really good stuff. So the quest system is being added. We're getting the quest system. Basically, you guys are going to be getting quests. Basically, the system, not the quests. So what are we getting with this? Basically, it tracks all of our active quests. We'll be able to turn in all of our bounties from the quest page instead of having to go to the tower. Screw that, because, you know, we don't have time for that. We just want to turn this crap in. It's abandoning all of the weapons. Basically, any quests you don't have completed, all your bounties you don't have completed, but any exotic bounties you have are getting automatically completed. You can just have them stacked up. They'll be automatically completed. That's something to look forward to. So stack up on those. Don't even worry about doing them. The, you know, the bounty slots are being increased. You know, yeah, that's pretty much it. All year one exotics are getting upgraded. Year one bounties will Eris will be... Oh, Eris is gone. That bitch is being thrown out off the balcony. She is gone. Nobody has to worry about her anymore because... Nobody even goes to her in the first place. So let's go ahead and move on to the fourth and final screenshot. Now this is when it really gets really cool. Talking about the new exotics. Now, I know everybody's really hyped for those. We got that sword we saw last time. We're going to be doing a video on that too. But quickly, basically collections have been added to the tower implement shaders like the kiosks. You know, all the kiosks are now basically being shown up. You guys don't know what that is. It's like a giant panel instead of these people that are going to be there. All of the blueprint system being added in. We're going to get that. Your inventory, Moats of Light will be able, now able to upgrade weapons and armor, which also makes me think that Taken King weapons and armor are also going to be dropping in the Crucible, like they were doing for House of Wolves. That was awesome. We'll cover that. You know, everything's getting replaced. You can also go check out the Vanguard Quartermaster to re-exchange your old, you know, Sapphire Wire, Plasteel Plating, Hydronic Essence, all that stuff, into the new armor material. Alright guys, that's pretty much it. That's going to be out with the 2.0 patch. One more thing, we're going to quickly say goodbye to the fucking Dinklebot. We're going to miss you, man. You were awesome. And we're going to welcome in Nolan North. He's also coming with a 2.0 patch. We're going to miss Dinklebot. Everybody loves Dinklebot. He was amazing. God bless Peter Dinklage. Alright guys, anyways guys, 
this has been it. This is the 2.0 batch coming out next Tuesday, a week before Tank King comes out. We'll be keeping up to date with that. If you guys enjoyed this upload, make sure you guys drop a like and comment. And if you finished the video all the way to the end, put Noodle in the comment section. Let's see who made it here. All right, guys, this has been Zylo, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.